All right. First off, I just want to say this has been the whole like past three minutes of me sitting here listening to the sound. I thought there was going to be music or something. Nope. It's just this. <laughs> hey guys, what's up? It's both your one Noli, and welcome to Looney Tunes World of Mayhem. Apparently, they made a Looney Tune game that just released and. It's been a while since I tried out new games again that didn't like a lot of, like, first impressions, basically. So, yeah, let's get back into it and start it up and see what's going on. Um, Alright, there we go. I knew I should have taken that left toy at Albuquerque. Oh, they actually have voice acting. Okay, that's that's kind of a shock. Oh, okay. I see. Excuse me, Doc. Do you know how to get the Pismo? So they will just keep replaying the sound <laughs> if I just sit here. Okay, that explains it. Oh dear, another Earth creature. Now I suppose I shall have to use force. Of course you realize, this means war. Oh dear god. This brings back a whole bunch of nostalgia stuff. When I actually used to watch Looney Tunes. Wait, this is 3D? Why did it look 2D to me? That wasn't nice at all. Luckily, I have my re-atomizer at hand. I have a lot of things I want to say. Say, Bob, here's a delivery for you. Okay, Bugs needs a nerf. Stop that thing, Bob. We haven't even finished the tutorial yet. Yeah, Bugs really needs a nerf, because that was just OP as hell. To be honest, Looney Tunes has always been about breaking the fourth wall. Hey, Doc! Yeah, you! This place is a mess, and I'm gonna need your help to fix it. I wanted you to stop lagging. <laughs> Alright, there you go. Alright, so. Welcome to Looney Tune World of Mayhem. Let's get into it, I guess. Are you just showing off the characters already? Jeez. Yeah, give me Bugs. He seems to be the most broken character ever. Oh god, it's a shark collector. Watch up, Doc. Just had to be a shark collecting game. So you also have daily. I don't know, I've never been, like, really interested in these type of games. Well, the cartoonies, at least. Like, um, what was it? Disney? But this one probably could be interesting. Probably. Well, damn, dude! Jesus Christ! I guess, is that a stun? Yeah, I figured. <laughs> Not only that, the animations are actually not half bad. What the hell? This is actually a decent game. Maybe not gonna hit a lot of people's like sense of humor though. I can definitely say that. Ten pieces of one tune. So it's basically like the whole shard summoning crap. I can't be the only one who didn't like um foghorn, right? Son. 
So it seems like they got different variations of the characters. Okay. So far, <laughs> what can I say? Um, uh, okay, alright then. You're just gonna start like that? First off, let's stop you. I'm doing any random crab that you're about to do. Taunting characters are always good. So basically, this is like a weird version of Summoner Wars. <laughs> But with shard collecting? Basically, from what I see. I wonder, do they have Road Runner? I want to see what skills Road Runner has. Or Coyote. <laughs> Wait, when they say Looney Tunes, do they have all the Looney Tunes? characters like uh, Lola and stuff the hell's that whatever that is give me that oh the witch ah wait who was that Sylvester yeah it was oh no that's his son I'm surprised I actually remember some of these characters. What the hell? <laughs> now it's definitely feeling I'm, like feeding off my nostalgia. Oh, there he is. I might just let him use his. Okay, I forgot about this dude too. I forgot who did he always fight with. There was one character he always beat the crap. Oh, he beat the crap out of Sylvester. That's who it was. <laughs> just remembered. Oh god, he taunts. I want am, dude. Okay, so he's gonna be uh, a healer. Why is Coyote standing like that? <laughs> That's my first question. Oh, wait, wait, hold on. He used that to his advantage? So, okay, I guess Coyote smartened up. Because normally it would it'd be the other way around. <laughs> I can definitely say it's probably not a game that's for everyone, for sure. Especially if you didn't grow up around, like, um, Looney Tune characters. Which, not a lot of people did. And also, this probably... Mm, I'm not sure yet, I'm not going to call it, but... I was going to say it does kind of seem pay to win so far. Or feel like it could be pay to win in the future. It's just because shark collecting has always been, like, extremely pay to win. But I'm going to give it the benefit of the doubt. Wait. Are we fighting the chest? Oh no, it's the whole, um... I guess you're fighting others and defending the chest until it opens. Why? Well then, that's gonna be interesting. So that's how you unlock uh, special skills, is with these um, dynamites. So I guess this is the last one before they let go of our hand. Oh, that's a um, Doug Dodger Porky Pig. 
Wait, hold up. So... Uh... Okay, ow. I was gonna say... One thing... If they don't have it in the future, they need Lunatics Unleashed. If they don't have it, I'm gonna be upset. Because Lunatics Unleashed was like... Probably one of my favorites, hands down. Nice to dodger, that is. Go ahead and finish you off. I just wanted to see some of the skills. I can definitely say the animation quality is definitely not half bad. They definitely did it like a really good job. Let's tell just in case he has some BS coming. Well, now he doesn't because he's stunned. Oh no, he gets. Instead of a stun, he got an attack down. Okay. So bug attacks down or stuns off of his um, little baseball bat. This is a very odd game. So now we have Brawl. So you can go around stealing other people's chests, basically. That totally sounds like fun, you know? So it's one of those really PvP heavy games. Is basically what it is. It's not like, um... Hmm. I wanna... Kinda make a... Statement to say it's kinda like, uh, what was it? Mighty Party? Somewhat like that. Where they give you, like, a couple of PvE areas, then it just goes straight to PvP. Heavy. Oh, he has me, uh, taunted. Could you not? What do I have to two people taunt? Ow. Kinda wanna s No, I didn't want to kill him. I wanted to see his, uh, special. Remember, change targets. Whoops. <laughs> And then you make it your own, basically. So the more characters you have to defend a chest, the better. Alright, we're done with the tutorial. Oh god, it lagged. Um, game, are you okay? How much would have bet it just went non response and about crash? I'm gonna call it right now. So it does seem like a little bit heavy, but it probably could be less heavy on phones, but yep, yep, there it is. All right, be right back. All right, and we're back. I switched over to Blue Sky because LD player was having like a lot of issues. From what I see, it doesn't have any like quality lowering, which is not a good idea. You should always have quality settings, and I wouldn't be surprised if the game came to Steam, also. Just saying that right now, I wouldn't be surprised. But it seems like we have a little bit of a chest here. What's in it? I recommend playing this game in blue stacks because it works a lot better. I have no idea what this is. Good, clean, wholesome fun. <laughs> Real question is, what does he do? All right, nothing special on his basics. He has stun on this too. 
He has a passive. Whatever an opponent is stunned, his gauge goes up quicker. Okay. More attack. As you can see, it's actually pretty, pretty decent um, strategy game. Seems like you can buy all their skills at once if you want to. Okay, so there's other show performers that you can actually pick. Do we have other ones that are done? Okay, now it's just showing us uh, those. So safe will have a chance to increase your attack. Oh, so they get other um, buffs as you go on. Okay, neat. So there's a, isn't just like one tune-up. There's so much more. Oh, and it goes all the way up to thirty. Okay, this could actually be really neat, to be honest. Oh, you can actually see a world map too? What the hell? Oh, you can actually make their own home. That's actually pretty dope. Alright, so they actually thought this one out. So any tune you get, you can pretty much put their house on the map. Throw that right there. And Bug's house is going to be... I don't think you can rotate it or anything, right? From what I know. At least... Let's put Bug's house over here. Oh, am I still in the red? Yeah, just a tad. Apparently I can upgrade his house. Unlock short test. Okay, so this will open up... Um... Okay, so the dynamites are for the first skills. Then you head into the others. So they're gonna start looking for those for you. Okay, that explains it. The well, performer isn't out here though. Is he all the way out here? Oh, yeah, he is! Neat, so they're in their own areas. So I can't do... Oh, I was about to say, I can't do any of this stuff anymore. So we also have a login going on. Free. Alright, so we gotta log in the next few days just to get that. So I can buy these if I need them. Oh, this is also free too. Let's open that. Oh, those are just downloaded this app and stuff. So is this the maximum price? Yeah. That seems to be. Wait, no, this is the maximum price. They're just ordered weirdly. Not sure if that's a good thing or bad thing yet. We earn tune-ups out of that. This is basically the summoning. Actually, you can get a lot of pieces for just summoning there. So I guess that really wouldn't be a half bad offer for like wells. 
Yeah, we got more. Helmer Fudd. Yeah, we got one more. That's actually pretty cool that they have all these um, different areas you can look at. I'm guessing this is um, Sylvester's place. You won't like that at level 30. Is my chest done? Yeah, 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 I know. If I wanted to be a douche and take somebody's chest, I could just be like, oh, well, you know, I'm in the need of a chest. Who's the highest level here? Well, not be the high level. Who has the most points? You? Alright, buddy. You're going down. <laughs> just to be that guy. To be honest, it only seems like you can hold one chest at a time. And guard that so anytime you don't have a chest you would take one and guard it basically oh they got times four speed jeez nice and that's his passive It's actually really nice that they have um, a faster speed. <laughs> what you actually thought you weren't gonna get hit? Considering you're the only guy here and you use stealth, <laughs> definitely not gonna work out. But that's actually pretty nice because they know how stealth works inside of uh, other like RPG related games. At least they know how to do that, right? So I can hold more as I level. Which is probably not the smartest thing to do until I have everything fully leveled. So. Okay. Yeah, I don't really care about the whole competing thing. I want to see, can I use the characters in campaign if I have them defending? Oh, I can't actually use you. Is he only usable outside of um, campaign? Well then, oh, that sucks. I guess you can only use three allies at the moment. Oh, let's just make that time two speed. I still like the animations. <laughs> That's exactly how Sylvester looks before he gets hit. <laughs> I don't know. I, I might play this game just like by myself, if anything. I, I don't know about creating like videos off of it. Definitely not the best game for myself. Just me personally, you know? Alright, let's do one more match here. Yeah, we know about all the skill holding crap. Oh, I didn't even realize that. You can see the HP of how much they have. Yeah, let's stun him before he gets his turn. Or try. No, we're gonna kill you just in case. We know he'll be fun. Jeez, dude, why are you so aggressive?
And you get resources for every completion. Wait, hold up. Something I've been checking. Okay, yeah, there is energy. I was about to say, is there energy for this? And our XP barely goes up after most of these completion. Okay, because those are 10. This one should increase us up. Ah, okay, I see, I see. So after that, we start getting like way, way more. Okay, let's make this the last one. But yeah, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. That's all the gameplay. Is it actually worth playing? Yeah, kinda. If you're an emulator player, then it's probably the best to use these stacks. It's way better than Nox because for some reason Nox doesn't have the game inside of their uh, Google Play, from what I've seen, which is really unfortunate. But if you're an LD player, uh, you're probably gonna have to use Blue Stacks just to play this game too, because Blue Stacks seems to be the only one working. For LD player, it freezes on this screen and you can't click anything; it goes non-response. Oh, you can auto win this now. Oh, okay. No, I was getting the same XP. I just it just lowers when you beat it. Hmm. Not sure how I feel about that. Well, let's go do some summons. Got Sylvester? Alright. Then we got Granny. That's a weird duo, but. <laughs> Consider they beat the crap out of each other. Or she beats the crap out of him. Yeah, it seems saving up for this is probably like way better at the moment. Cause you don't get too much for those. Oh my god, just all that spitting just reminds me of <laughs> of him so much. So they go up to seven stars as well. What does Sylvester even have? For his tune-ups. Okay, never mind, that's gonna be one. For his basic attack, he has a chance of hitting a second time. He also goes into hidden, so he's more of like an assassin type, even though most of his assassinations have never worked out on Tweety, but you know, we're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> While hide, you have a chance of defense downing. Okay, nice. Attack speed increase. Yeah, he's literally mostly an assassin, for sure. Good for taking out squishies. So yeah, there's a lot of strats in this game. Very, I would say, kid-friendly, if anything. Is if you're going to, trying to get your kid into like a strategy, well not strategy, RPG game, this is probably the best one so far. Just because you like all their favorite cartoon characters just chilling. But yeah guys, we're going to end it there. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you actually enjoyed the game, try it out yourself. As for me, I am done. So then, peace out. Swear it's gonna get better real soon. Don't let anyone tell you what you should do. I got a clear view. We're gonna make it soon. Just keep pushing through. Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Yo, what you got to lose? Just keep pushing through. Cause what you got to lose?